the VPO waveform display technology in the GDS3000 significantly boosts waveform capture rates to match the performance of analog oscilloscopes when capturing general signals. In addition to traditional horizontal and vertical axis adjustment, the GDS3000 can also adjust the waveform intensity, allowing you to observe the most subtle changes. First activate any input channels connected to the surge signals. Press the auto set key and adjust the time division to the best scale. Press the display button and set the waveform gray or color option on the bottom menu to color. At this point it is clear that the waveform is displayed with different colors. Red represents data that appears more often and blue represents data that appears less often. By showing waveforms in different colors it allows us to easily grasp the strength of incidental waveforms that don't commonly occur. Toggle the waveform gray or color icon back to gray. Press the intensity key on the bottom menu and use the variable knob to adjust the intensity. This demonstrates how a surge waveform looks similar on the GDS3000 and on an analog oscilloscope with similar levels of luminance. Aside from incidental waveform analysis, VPO technology can also be used to also analyze video signals. Activate channel to an input a video signal. To match the video input impedance, set the input impedance to 75 ohm. Press the auto set key and adjust the time base. VPO waveform display technology can be used to clearly observe video waveforms. In conclusion, we can clearly see how using VPO technology allows us to view waveforms when they change. Users can easily analyze infrequent occurrences and video waveforms. It is the best tool for signal analysis.